My name is Irisol Gonzalez. I'm a Charlotte-based artist. So I did the trains that are now installed downtown. I painted the little sculptures. So my style is realism mostly, but I use a lot of color and I use a lot of repetition. I mix all of my colors. So I only use yellow, red, and blue, and white. And then I make all of the colors from there. The concept that I came up with was to do like past to present. And so the way that the mural works is this is past and then it goes to the present. And that's why it starts with black and white. It transitions to black and white color and ends in full color. The trains follow the history that was happening at the time. So when you see what's surrounding them is what was happening as those trains were coming through the town. You just follow the trains. It starts from the top, comes down, from the bottom goes up and then transitions all the way down into people still watching the trains go by. One important thing and the curious thing that I did and I hope that people find is that the entire mural is between two rivers. So I did the South Fork River and then the Catawba River and so everything that has happened it's in between just like Belmont is. I enjoyed the technique that I used in all of the brick. All of the brick is very different and all of the bigger around the mural. I like the little things that I included, like on the bank, there's a, a sign that's about this big and it says all deposits are guaranteed because when the Great Depression happened, the Bank of Belmont closed for one day and then they put out a sign that said that all deposits were guaranteed. The flood scene, 1916, and it's done in Impressionist style because you have to deconstruct and construct the image in order to see it and that's what the town had to do after the flood. The Belmont Girls was really fun to do. The images that I had to go from were black and white so I had to do them like Photoshop them in my head to be colored. I was given a lot of creative freedom and with a lot of creative freedom I just get really excited about things and then I go overboard on details so I really like the amount of different styles that I've got in, in the whole thing.